In the cloudy skies of southern Siberia, Russia launches its first moon mission in almost five decades. On board the Soyuz rocket is the Luna 25 spacecraft, which Moscow hopes will be the first ever to land on the lunar south pole. It's a test for Russia's space program after many Western sanctions over the war in Ukraine impacted the country's aerospace sector. Western sanctions imposed on Russia uh, prevented them access to very high performance microelectronic components which they need for their spacecraft. So this particular um, spaceship, Luna 25, actually had European instrumentation originally scheduled for it. When the invasion happened, the Europeans pulled out their stuff. So they've had to really rejig the whole thing and make it workable. Luna 25 is due to touch down on the moon around August 21st. Over the next year, it will be tasked with collecting samples of moon rock and dust and conducting research. The lunar south pole is of particular interest to scientists, with the region believed to hold coveted pockets of water ice. Last month, India launched its Chandrayaan-3 spacecraft on a mission to the moon's south pole after a previous attempt failed in 2019. Meanwhile, the US and China both have advanced exploration programs targeting the lunar south pole.